got any new notebooks or anything for the leap start? Well, one downside is that you have to actually manually download it through software, and this is the full guide on how to do so. So yeah, this guide works either even if you have the Elite Start 3D or the, the original one. So let's get started. All you gotta do is firstly go to leapfrog.com slash connect, I'll leave that in the description, and then Leap Start Learning Systems, it has to be that one. It's all different software depending on which device you have. So if you press download, wait a bit, and then open the setup, so yeah, you're about to install that. Next. Agree. Next. Next. And then just wait for it to download. Once it's downloaded, click next. And then the app will open. Now, next up, all you gotta do is connect your leap start. Now, this is pretty damn important. So listen up. Basically, not all micro USB ports will actually work with it. Some of them aren't as powerful, and it's only just to power the actual leap start. You have to get one that will be powerful and data, like this one. If it looks, like, powerful, it probably is. That's just how I work it out. It has, like, a little, like, circular thing, like a, a cylinder-like thing on it. Then, yeah, that's, um, also a powerful one. Now, connect it in. There we go. And then... It will turn on its uh, turn on on its own, and then yeah, just gotta wait a little bit. All right, you'll be seeing this once it's all connected, and focus. You have to either set up a new account if you don't have a Leapfrog account, or you only do log in. I already have one. Once your device is all set up and all that logged in, it'll be all set up. Uh, it may end up downloading a few um, notebooks and stuff, and yeah. After that, I'll say it's ready to play. So yeah, it gives you a bit of tips and tricks on like the companion audio page, which that's the actual software that you need to actually access these books. It will remind you if you get a new one, and yeah. So next, next, next. So yeah, you can either install individual ones or install the whole series. So yeah, for example, um, a bag for Sam. Install, and then it will start installing. And yeah, these typically have like 200 megabytes or megabytes. I call them megabytes or gigabytes or terabytes or whatever the fuck. Anyway, here is. Well, it's nearly downloaded. Sync complete. And now. Okay. So yeah. And also, if you want to remove a book, press remove. And then it will just start removing. And then yeah, it's been removed. And that's all you need to know. Hope this helps.